Good afternoon and welcome to Top of Freak. Chimama Drake is my name and today I'm interviewing Dennis. Good day. My name is Dennis Danzo Widely. Dennis, how and when did you start playing football? Um, I start at the age of three um, playing for a small side here in Hamburg, junior team called SEO Run. And um, how many teams have you played for so far? Um, so far I've been playing for about like, I think seven or eight. Uh, teams so far, yeah. yeah. And can you name some? Um, yeah, um, like Hamburg, Hamburg has found Vorwärtsbacher. Right now, I'm even playing for Babelsberg in Berlin. Um, I even played for youth side at Arsenal in England. Yeah, these are like some of them. Which country would you prefer to play for? I would prefer to play for Ghana. Um, it's like how should I say that? I'm blessed, I'm black, and it was a dream for me always to play for my motherland. And I know that Ghana never have won the World Cup, so I might try to achieve some of it, like to, to like, get a good team together and play and try and get a good result with the team that I play with them. Um, don't you think that the European Youth Tournament would give you a better platform? Yeah, it will, but to me, like, I said to myself and I talked to my mom and I said, if I get the chance, I'll play for Ghana. And does your father or mother possess a German passport? No, actually, no, they're not. Well, so I'm holding the Ghana Ghana passport, yes. All right. um, by the way, the senior national teams, Germany and Ghana, which one do you have in heart to represent in the future? To be honest, <laughs> yeah, like, if I could choose, I would do both, but I would do, I prefer Ghana, I prefer Ghana. And why? Why? I don't know, um, funny, I, like I was saying before, like, for me it's a dream, it was always a dream to play for Ghana, so if I had the chance to play for Ghana, I would prefer playing Ghana for Germany, but if the chance were there to play for Germany too, I would do that same. Um, Ghanaians can be very tough when it comes to national team. Do you think you can handle them when you do something wrong? Yeah, okay, I've noticed it, but like like I was saying, uh, um, I'm, let's say I'm ready for it. I'm ready for it. Um, which position do you play? Um, normally, my, I play right back, right back, but I could play any other position too. And um, are you good in both foot? I mean, do you play both left and right? Are you comfortable? Yeah. At first, it was very hard to, for me to play with my left. But as it was going on, I was fighting and learning hard. So right now, I'm quite good with it, with both. Dennis, you can play two, three, four, five. And um, which one is your favorite position? Like, for me, it's like playing two. Because there, I've got the opportunity to take the ball and go up front so i prefer that side okay. playing wing and um, do you feel comfortable when it comes to overlapping of course but let's say after two or three times it would be hard for me but i try my best to do often as i can to feed my mid players with good passing um, can you play any of the middle third positions i mean which one Buying the strikers. Buying the strikers is my favourite if I could choose to play in any midfield position. Buying the strikers. And um, what is your mentor when it comes to football? Who is your idol or your model? I can name some of it, but like, that really, like, from the kid of uh, when I was starting playing football was Abedi Billy. Oh, nice. And why? Mm, first of all, because he's Ghanaian mm -hmm. and he's representing us as Ghanaian. So, I don't know, he was very skillful and I loved the way he was playing and doing his stuff at the field. So, yeah, that's basically what I like about him. And um, are you looking into any justify or inclusion before the beginning of the season? Yeah, of course. Like, the first thing I'll do is. To be honest, like to pray that because I had the injury before, and that's the I think the most important thing to 
try and play the season successfully without any injury or any inconvenience, any bad thing. So to me, like let's say this season, um, my wish for myself was to play as far as like more than 30 games if I could do it. For me to represent myself and to like get like more attention from higher leagues to get offers there. And then what are your weak points? Weak points, <laughs> let's say so far I haven't scored any goal yet, so I guess I'll put that one on my weak point then. Yeah. Oh, but right. I'm working on it, I'm working on it. Okay. Alright then, back to privacy. Um, with the exception of football, do you have any other hobbies? Like something you like to do in your free time? Me, yeah, I like to hang around with my friends with my brother. Um, I love to go swimming on travel. Travel? Yeah, travel. Which countries have you been to yet? Um, apart from Ghana, I've been in the US, uh, many states in Europe, and uh, in. Where are those? Yeah, that's it, that's, that's it, basically, yeah. And um, which one did you like most? Which country did you like most? I was very surprised when I went to Romania because before I went, I thought like people have been telling me that it's a poor country and what am I doing there. But to me, it was like experience going there. So if someone asked me, I could talk about it. So it was very nice there, though. I was there even for I think two weeks, and I even decided with my brother to go there any time from now if you get free time. Once again, yeah. You've been only talking about your brother, your brother. Do you have any other siblings? <laughs> okay, to be honest, like my brother's like my best friend. If I get any problems, I call him. Even he's younger than me. But he's playing football too, so if I need any advice, I call my dad, my mom, but my brother's like oh, one like we want we very close. So if you got any problems you phone me, if I got problems we phone and then we discuss about the matters and then we see like end of the day I'll do my own decision but I still need someone to talk to and mm. that's why I like I name my brother so because yeah. Okay. He helps me a lot. So Dennis, when you play for the Bundesliga, we will get to will we get to see you again like have a face-to-face interview again? <laughs> or will you be so busy that we will get to see you again? <laughs> I don't know, but no, no, I won't forget for you. I will anytime I'll be there, anytime. I'll do it again. Okay, audience. Dennis will remember us. You have us in mind. <laughs> okay, thank you very much, Dennis, for your time. And we wish you all the best for the future. And we hope that you fulfill all your dreams and God is always by your side. Um, this was Top of Freak and Jemima Drake is the name again. Thank you for watching.